My name is Veronica van der Kamp. I'm a community leader. And yeah, in my community, they call me the Ghana Opera. <laughs> How open are people in the Ghanese uh, community about safe sex? In my community, it's still difficult to talk about it because the stigma is very, very, very big. We have to find a way to deal about the stigma. What I do is I use drama as a tool to give information and educate the community. So with the drama, people talk more indirectly about themselves using the characters that they see in the movies. So we have to do more of this. And things like this have to be supported. So the, it makes the message more lightly and people are more open to talk about it. So the stigma should be so dealt with. It's very important. How did you learn about HIV? HIV, I came here in my 30s and uh, back home, say HIV, I mean, it's so far. But when I come to the Netherlands, I saw how, yeah, it's like it was so close and it was being talked about and people are just so free, which I wasn't used to. So, so yeah, it was strange to me that people were so open about it here. Do you see parallels? Uh, between COVID and HIV? At the moment, <laughs> COVID has been so scary that uh, even the fear of HIV in my community is really down. I think people are not really scared about it anymore. They are, the stigma is still there, but COVID has come to make it lighter. Why is it important not to forget the other pandemic? We can't forget about HIV because um, the stigma is still there and we still have to take precautions. Um, I was just saying it's lighter because HIV, you can use the condom to protect yourself, but COVID, there's no condom to <laughs> protect that. And what would your personal message be for the people for this World AIDS Day? You know, the professionals have to work with us in the community. When the professionals are coming outside to tell the people about HIV and things, they feel that fingers are being pointed at them. But when we ourselves in the community are addressing the issue, sometimes it's more accepted. <laughs> HIV is still there, and we have to be very cautious about that. Save yourself and save your loved ones. <laughs>